I'm, I'm videoing this for a guy called Stephen Elston. Do you remember him? Oh, that's the bench. Okay. We're on the uh, first floor at the end of the new building. I can't remember. I think this was my form room at some point. Maybe in the first year. And Mrs. Bennett, the French teacher, was our form teacher, I think. But of course, like many of the rooms, it's been altered. It's had the end chopped off. These were big rooms. And we certainly never had an electronic whiteboard or any sort of whiteboard and we didn't have carpet on the floor and the idea that they might teach psychology would have been quite a laugh so they've made a little I suppose these are like teacher offices or something at the end and there's the you can see out the window here the science block through the trees. We're not allowed to go in the science block because it's got asbestos in apparently. So this is looking out of that room and those steps are so familiar. I think it must have been the first year I was in this room. This was the geography room where Mr. Barn Barnyard used to teach from the front here. And I always remember he spent time, I do remember this little back room, and many of the little back rooms have been carved out of the main building, but this one, oh, it's locked unfortunately, but look at the original handle there, nice 50s handle. And Mr. Barnard used to emerge from that, 
little room at the back in a strange way. Now this was the old physics room. So there's no sign of it as a lab. You can see the bike sheds through the window. So I think this must be some kind of cafeteria. in here. And now this is the old part, upper step and the, the parquet flooring. It's interesting how it's the flooring that I remember. And there's Anne again. <laughs> Oh, yeah, this was two rooms. Yeah. Yeah. No, but if you look between them, I don't know that. Oh, perhaps not. Can you open up the main staircase? No, we haven't been anywhere. Is it, uh, someone told me they weren't there anymore. What, the main staircase? Yeah, the not. staircase? The staircase. They were lovely, weren't they? You, Janet? Yes. Jane Hitchcock. Oh gosh! <laughs> I thought I'd make a nice joke. Oh gosh! I was good. Where have you come? How far have we come? Do you live here? I'm Hardingham. No, not far away. No, no. we're between. No, that was uh, that weren't a sign. I don't have this room. So there were two no, That was one. We were not in the wood. That was wood <laughs> and glass. That's right. Absolutely. But that's when I, when a sliding we, door, was it? With glass. No, that was a sliding door. A folding one. A folding door. I, I don't remember you could see through it, but I know that had glass and wood. That was very dark brown wood, as it would have been. Yeah, there were two classrooms, weren't there? Yeah, there were one there. there. Yeah. There's there's one there, there and one here. When we first, first, first came. Year. Year. first year, I think you're right. First this year this was years four and five when we first came. Were you here when it did? No. No, we were no. gone by then. We were gone in 75, 76. And that started in 81. Yeah. Yeah, and then, yes, we had long. Well, I only remember because my children were the first year of of the comprehensive school. Right. And they were born with Miss Yeah, with Mr. Yeah, yeah, but they were. Sorry, right. Anyway, when when we went comprehensive, Anderson was head here. Did and he amazing. took over the whole caboose. Both sides. Both sides. Oh, right. And within a year, he had had enough and resigned. And Lumpkin, who was had a head as a cop, had the secondary modern school, oh, sorry. was dead. Sorry, sorry you carry on. Okay. Yeah, I think he died at a Masonic meeting. Well, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. We'll see what we yeah, This was the cloakroom. So this was the cloakroom, bloody hell. <laughs> it couldn't have been as big as this, surely. And someone told me this was the staff room. It's looking back down the corridor. And then coming into the, oh, I remember this well, so this was the entrance door. So all the passageways are so familiar because they're the same. I always thought this was very grand. And the prefects used to stand right where I'm standing. If you tried to come in the school, they would generally exclude you. So over here, there used to be a little cupboard Still here, quite tiny. It's not so tiny. But this was a little stock cupboard. And when you needed a new exercise book, you'd go here. And then just to the right, this was the tuck shop. This was the tuck shop. Unbelievable. And we used to queue up. We used to queue up in this corridor for tuck. This, oh, this was scary.
And apparently this is the staff room, but I didn't know what it was before. And then this was the most dreaded room of all, because this was the headmaster's study. God knows what use it was now. This was the most terrifying place of all. So it was the headmaster's study when I was here. <laughs> well, it'll make a nice sitting room for someone. He had a problem to start with. He couldn't get money from it. No, no. She had a secretary and the headmaster didn't care. And now the, uh, the corridor just behind Nats's office. Oh my God. <laughs> I wonder what they've ripped out of here. Wider corridor. I don't remember. <laughs> I'd forgotten that the classrooms had windows looking onto the corridor. So I remember doing English literature. I seem to remember in here. You reckon? I reckon. In 1968, maybe? What do you remember of this? Uh, I can't remember. I mean, I was here 50, 50, 51, 56. Wow. Yeah. Um, I can't remember. I can't remember. What, what does seem familiar to you? Um, there wouldn't have been any of this in. I think it was just a classroom. Yes, it was. Uh, with more, more. Oh, the best. Mm. Um, Where you know the swimming pool was constructed on the far side of the gym. Oh yeah, the gym is gone, that's and all. the woodwork room is gone. So, that's, uh, and that was the music room, wasn't it? There was that the music room oh, in yes, your time? Course. Yes, of course, that's right. Yes. And course. then upstairs was the biology lab. There was a there was a drinking fountain in it. Was that still there in your day? Yes, I've forgotten. Yeah, yes. the drinking fat. Yeah, yes. this guy, isn't it? Well, at the end, the far end of that alleyway was uh, there is still is a steel staircase up, and that was into a look. Uh, I remember about this one is wait. We used to wait for bus here because our bus used to come later or something. Oh, you didn't. You weren't the same bus. So we used to sit there waiting for the bus. Did you? Yes. Mm. Yeah. Right. Um, it must have been two classrooms, wasn't it? You know, I think I've bypassed my first form room. I'll have to get back there and have a look at it because it was wasn't here. She told me off for not wearing my hat and beating oh, chips. Yes. <laughs> she used to tell all the girls I should leave the boys alone. We were okay. We oh, just had yeah. uh, Robinson used to tell us. I thought it was his oh. name. Lionel. Yeah, I, I don't know. They called him Cardi. Lionel, obviously. Dr. Luce. Dr. Luce. Oh, Dr. Luce. Dr. Luce. He Luce. left. He, I was met someone who remembered it. He must have gone on a long time. You know. Oh, he was there for years. Yeah, he I was there was. for years, yeah. wasn't he? Um, he died about um, 10 years ago, I think. He was, he was well He's really life. old, wasn't he? Yeah, yeah. So, you see, he never stayed for a meeting after school, did he? He was deputy head, but he never stayed for a meeting <laughs> after school. Who's that? Well, Dr. Luce. Because oh, he went yeah. to him on the bus. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> He had his priority. Yeah. He was a good teacher. But, was, but they used to have a staff meeting once, <laughs> one lunchtime a month. Really. And, and if there was a lot going on, the lunch would be extended. You may come in. Listen to the So carry on, carry on in, carry on in. Sure Are you I'm Richard Arms? Sure I am. Yeah, I'm Adrian Stringer. Stringer. Oh, hello. <laughs> Adrian, oh my God. 69, I couldn't get out fast enough, so nothing is familiar apart from the, the stairs. Now I've no idea what this was. Was this the library? It's all shiny shiny. It's all, 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 it's all,
No, what was it? A library? Was this, this where was the senior? This was the senior library, wasn't it? It looks small now. Yeah. And the junior library was way down the yeah. other end these on the ground floor. These are the two biggest rooms, these two. That's why this yeah. was the library. You're absolutely right. I forgot this was the library. It just looks so small now. It looks quite big when I was a boy. There's a bookcase down the end. Ah, and... oh, now we can get the view of where the, where the oh, woodworks. <laughs> the wood, what's happened to woodwork? <laughs> well, that was, um, that was a fire. 203. Oh. 203. Yeah. So it was 14 years ago. Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. 203. And um, there was a minibus where that Cotton Beach is. And that's yeah. what they actually set fire to. Yeah. And then that, that was the point. Windows, there. Isn't it? And then it did the. Uh, both ways. Did the gym and the shadows. And that, what we called Woodwork Run, and that was a drama room by then. Yes. Yeah. Way. But they were actually old stables, those bits, weren't they? And the gym, I don't know what the gym was originally okay. from the old hall. No, I don't. But I remember coming down the day after it happened and seeing all this stuff on the yeah. side of the pool melted. Yeah, I had to come over that morning. John caught the me had to come over and it's a very far few things. So I, all I lost was like clothes and stuff that were in this office in this room here. Oh, what, in the changing rooms? Yeah, changing rooms, we got yeah. an office upstairs there where the girls were. Where the girls were, yeah. We've got a PD office up there. Sorry, which years were you, sir? Um, I was 62 to 69. Oh, well, we crossed over then. What yeah. were you? I was Vanessa Stocking. Rupert Stocking was my brother. I know your name. He would have been your year. Yes, I know your name. Stocking. Yeah, where, were you, where did you live? Walsingham. Right. And where are you now? <laughs> Baking them for my sins. <laughs> are you not moved away from Norfolk? Oh, yes, I taught away for 25 years. Mm, I was and away. And then I came back. Me too, I was away for 30 years and I came back. Good grief. Yeah. So where are you then now? Kettlestone. Kettlestone. And where were you before? Burnham Thorpe. Burnham Thorpe. I'm just trying to think. People who came from the Burnhams, quite a few people. Yes. So you were 63, did you say? Or 62. 62. So you were fourth year when I was first year. So you came on the bus that came from that direction, whereas I came on the Wells bus. Yes. And yes. your name? Richard Ives. Richard Ives, yes, Ives. that rings a bell. <coughs> Is it? You were my brother's year. I'm just trying to think of some of the bad boys. Stephen Alston? No, Stephen was a good boy, Holcomb. <laughs> How funny, I was talking to Alan Corrigan, who lived at Holcomb, mother ran beach coma in High Street, in well, State Street in Wales. He went on to Wyndham College, as many of our different years had the chance yeah, to. Yeah. And we got talking about Stephen Alston. Yeah. yeah. And I'm a member friend of his on Facebook, not that means much. But yeah, Stephen. Like he couldn't make it, so I'm, I'm making a few bits of film of the building. Because <laughs> <laughs> I worked at Holcomb Pottery during my holidays. My mother worked at Holcomb Pottery and knew Mr. Elston Senior very well. Yeah. And then there were various daughters, Laura and Sarah and Co. Yes. Mm. Was... Still around? Jared's Jared's around? Yes, and yeah. I'm a friend of Thomas Matthews. Oh, yeah, yeah. Did you say hi to Stephen Elston for me? Uh, you uh, you said it yourself. Uh, the rest of my year, um, the two head boys couldn't be here. There's a deputy head boy here from my year. Um, tomorrow I'm with people like John Tuck, Jane Lawson, Frank Lawson's daughter. I'm in contact with a lot. I've got 40 mm. odd. I've got contact with 80 odd of my year, but no well 40 odd of my year. Have you had a reunion then? Yeah, three years ago was my last one and that was my last one. Uh, you're not on any more? Well, again, it's the, we came back to the building. We had a hot roast here. Oh, uh, yeah. It was the last year that the dining room was open, so we used that, oh, the old dining room. Um, yeah, we could patrol wherever we wanted to go. Um, so not many of my year have come back because they wanted to remember it three years ago when I had Colin Way, who I don't think you got, Eckersley, you had, didn't you? Yeah, I remember Colin. He was he succeeded Eckersley, That's so right. for one year. He must have come in the, six, the 69 year. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, well, I had contact with him and oh, nice. I had Mr. Right. Duane yes. here. Did you have Mr. Duane? Um, John Tuck here. Um, Mrs. Bennell here. I had eight staff. Mrs. Mm. Bennett. Do you remember Mrs. Bennett? I definitely, I've been thinking about her a lot because she was my form teacher and she yeah, taught she, French. She was a difficult lady, if you remember. I didn't find her difficult, I just wasn't interested in French. <laughs> she okay. was young, she struck yes. me, she must have been really oh, young. She must have been, like Mrs. Bennett was young. When you were here, we had history in here, Red 
Well, where was the library then? Downstairs? Oh. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. The library was downstairs. Yeah. I thought it was upstairs. No. Yeah. I thought it was upstairs. No, I, thought was I thought the library was here. Yeah. Mind you. Memory is very fallible, isn't it? Okay. Library upstairs or downstairs? I remember the library I remember is the one with the external wooden staircase. Oh God, that's when it changed. That was, yeah, that's yeah. the one. You're below us, so yes. Oh, nice talking to you, Vanessa. Talk to you, Richard, yes. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yes. That's me. Oh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Bye. This is the room on the first floor. I think we had history in here. I think this was our form room at some time. Maybe in the third or fourth year. I don't remember. But I seem to remember Mr. Dixon teaching RE and failing to control the class. And then, further along this first floor corridor, so this was the staff room somewhere, wasn't it? Do you remember that? The men's staff room? Yeah, it's changed a lot. Yeah. I'm sure I had that as my form room at some point. <laughs> Memory, is, is, it exposes the fragility of my memory, actually. <laughs> so this room looks out towards the back of the swimming pool and down the back lane. And maybe this was... This is the room. I don't remember having lessons in this room. It's got a lovely view. That's the front drive. And of course the tennis courts have gone. There were quite a few tennis courts out there. I didn't realise how big an area it was. And look at this front room with its shutters on the window. Again, I've no idea what was going on here. And the room opposite. So many little cubby holes. This one just off the top of the stairs again. A nice room. Jesus. A room, a little room looking out towards where the. Is that the boy prefix, I think, wasn't it? I don't know. And then we're back to the. Uh, <laughs> still got all the nice windows. Some of the windows have still got shutters on. Yes, yes, the room that I was. Initially, through the other side, it's not got the shutters. Yeah. I don't remember this at all. So what are these? Are these a uh, language? Yeah. This is just stud walls. <laughs> was this the... This could have been the women's staff. Where was the... Women's staff room. It was opposite. The end was over. At one stage was here. That's it, yeah. But it then ended up on the sort of ground floor. Yeah, well, I don't remember. Yeah, yeah. Someone so, mentioned that, but I don't remember. Yeah. So it was here. It was here. This was ah, the This was, yes. Well, the men's was right at the end on this floor. Yeah. And yeah. Should, until they merged yeah. them together. Um, the smoking was not allowed in the women's staff room. It was in the yes, men's I staff room. Yes, I think so. Yeah. So the women who did smoke, yeah. of which there are a few, yes. used to go in... Yeah. To the men's room. Yeah. 
Why do you think it's like that? Because I'm going to use it. 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 I'm going to use and Richard's had his lifelong ambition fulfilled. He's been in the girls' yes. prefects. Oh, we're, we're here. What here? Yeah. He's never been. We were allowed to paint it, and we painted it bright orange. Did you? Yeah, <laughs> bright orange. <laughs> Wonderful. Color. Oh, those were the sixties, yeah. eh? Wow. So now we're at the secret staircase that I didn't even know existed, and uh, just above where the female prefects were. So now you're up really high, you can see back across to the science labs there. This is most mysterious. Look at this little staircase. Oh, wow. Thank you. No. The bell just went, so we're going to try and find the end of it and get the bell ringing again. Oh. <laughs> so this, this is locked, but this were, these were the, like the changing rooms. And then there were toilets through here. Well, this was a passageway through and the bike sheds. Oh, I wish I had a cigarette to smoke. Yes, so that was the other side of the They were the toilets with a passageway through and then more bike sheds. I can't believe there's no woodwork room. Most of the woodwork tools are in the back end of the, what was the canteen? Is it? Yeah, it's uh, quite a lot. Of, we moved it, put it in there. Uh, So, the canteen in the quad. Look at this. Gee, it's a long time there. So, presumably, the, the canteen door is much the same, but it's locked. And now, the groundsman's hut. This cannot be the. I had a feeling the groundsman's hut was closer. We used to play cards. I don't see that's going to be open. And this is. Oh, that's the back of the swimming pool. So that's where the urinals were. So this was the music room. God knows what it was. Ultimately, because it's got black out at the window, but the sign says which you cannot go up. 
And this was a shed, I can't remember what the grounds were kept in there, but that shed was there. And this was the backyard, so yeah, we used to go in here to the uh, to the tuck shop, but of course it's gonna be closed now. Oh it's not. Yes, yeah, so we went in here to the tuck shop. Had a chance to say hi. <laughs> Hello. I can see you like yes. an apparition in the background. Yes. Wow. When are you here? 62 to 69. Oh, you see, 59 I left, didn't I? So. Toilets, but do you know I didn't know this existed? Maybe we weren't allowed down here. No entry. No unauthorised persons. Please keep this door locked. IT workshop, locked doors, so the swimming pool, and then this was all generally out of bounds of course, unless you were playing tennis or something. It's a grand building. I suppose the Georgian part goes from there. It's a very narrow building. I think that's my lot. So this was the bus park. Well, it certainly brings back some memories. Just thinking about the, how I didn't enjoy the bus ride because I was bullied on oh. the bus. Get hit on the back of your head with a, the peak of the cap. Yeah. And they'd put their neckties around your neck and put you back oh, in the seat like horrible. that. No, I think um, I, I liked it when the, when the teachers were actually characters. Yes. And they had a passion for their subjects. Yeah. yeah. What year did you come here? Um, I think it was 66. Do you know, we didn't, we were so lucky, I think, being girls, we didn't get any of that sort of thing, because no. you keep hearing bits and pieces like that, but... No, really? Like they weren't bitchy to you? Really. The other girls, no? Yeah. Yeah. I can't remember anything like that, not really, not at all. No. So, yeah, it has brought back memories, it really has. It's, I, I mean, I sort of a good experience, you know, really enjoyed it here, and I think it's just quite a special place. And I was saying to Pauline as I was walking around here, yeah, I dream about it a lot. So perhaps I won't anymore now. I think I've blotted out a lot of the yeah, memory because well, it, wasn't, it wasn't a good time. I didn't enjoy it. I hated it. I hated it. My brother loved it. My brother, sorry, my brother hated it, as Stephen will tell you, and I loved it.